Hi everyone, this is Anson from AnsonAlex.com and in this video I'm going to show you how you can change and or set the default printer on your Mac OS X computer. And you have a few different options here. So in order to do this, what we need to do is we need to access our printer settings here in Mac OS X. And to do that, we're going to go to the top left of our screen and click on the Apple menu. From here, we're going to click on System Preferences. When the System Preferences window pops up, we're going to go to the section that says Printers and Scanners. Now, you may or may not have the printer you're looking for already in your list. If it's already in your list, great. We'll talk about how to set it as your default printer in a second. If it's not in your list, you may have to click on the plus icon and click Add Printer or Scanner. When you do that, it's going to look for any printers that are currently connected to your computer. And if there aren't any printers connected to your computer, it's going to look for printers that are connected to the same network that you're on, so the same wireless network. So if you have a wireless printer, you need to make sure that your wireless printer is connected to your Wi-Fi network. And there should be instructions on how to do that that came with the printer. And then you need to, and then you need to make sure that your computer is also connected to the same wireless network. And the printer should appear here in the list. Once you see the printer you want, go ahead and just click on it and click Add down here at the bottom. Now I've already got two printers in here, so let's talk about how we can set the default printer. The setting for this is at the bottom of this window that popped up in our printer settings where it says Default Printer. And we have a few different options. We can either choose the last printer that we used, which is useful for people who are always going to different locations and they're going to be at one location for a whole day. They just print once to the printer they want to print to and then every time they try and print again, it'll use that last one that they used until they changed it. Now at the same time, we can also specify a specific printer that we always want to be set to default by just choosing it in the list here. So matrix printer is the one on my home network, on the matrix network. So if I wanted to use that printer as default all the time, I could just select it here from the list and that's all I have to do. You'll notice that the word default goes next to the printer in the list and I could just hit the little red X at the top of my settings window to close this out and the matrix printer would always be my default printer for printing. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, I would really appreciate a thumbs up here on YouTube. And if you wanna see more technology tips and tutorials, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. That's all I have for you for today. This is Anson from AnsonAlex.com.